Okay, this is probably the most difficult text completion in this new online paper-based GRE. One part of the reason why is really trying to figure out what the sentence is saying. Some keywords here are antithetical. Antithetical means opposite. It says somewhat antithetical. So these two, tra two truths that are more or less opposite. And it says these two antithetical truths that sounded blank come to seem profound. So come to seem is a shift here meaning we're going from one word to the other, to the opposite. So it goes from blank to profound, come to seem profound, we can say, aha, the first blank is opposite to profound. And just like that, we can figure out what that word must mean. We look at A. A says deep, deep and profound. Those are the same things. If something's profound, it's deep, philosophically speaking. So we get rid of A. Portentous. Portentous means you are speaking in this bombastic manner. You're very serious about what you say. Now that someone who's portentous could be profound even though they're you know, puffing their chest out a little and trying to sound very important or they may not be profound but it's definitely not the opposite of profound. But now commonplace, lacking originality, definitely the opposite of profound. So there we go. Now we look at the second leg. Knowledge of the past comes entirely from written documents. Giving words great what? Well, the only way we can know about the past is through words. So words are very important. They're of great consequence. And just like that, we have answer choice D. Watch out for E, antiquity. That just means, yeah, of course, antique or old. But that's a trap just because you see history, you know, something in the past doesn't mean it's antiquity. Then we finally look at the third blank. And the more material you uncover, the more blank your subject becomes. Now, don't forget this antithetical part, the somewhat antithetical. The idea that, wow, written words are so important. But the more written words you get, actually, it doesn't make historical research so much easier. It doesn't make your subject suddenly come to life. Your subject becomes more elusive. That is answer choice G.